evening. Well, first this morning, we have board president of the Huntington Children's Museum, Tasha Pelfrey. Thanks for coming in again, Tasha. Thank you so much for having me. Yes. yes. And you have such a fun event coming up. Talk to us about Kids Fest. Sure. So this is our third annual Kids Fest. It will be hosted, it will happen from June 8th to June 15th. Uh -huh. Kids Fest is a celebration of children through family-friendly events. So we'll have a week's worth of fun mm -hmm. um, with events like, um, and it a life-size board game, a teddy bear clinic where children Aww. can have their teddy bears checked out, um, all kinds of engineering events and hands-on activities. There's really something for everyone. Oh, that is so cute. And we're looking at pictures of some of the events and activities from last year. This, I'm guessing, is getting bigger and bigger every year. Yes, so um, our attendance almost doubled last year, so we're, we're excited. <laughs> we're, we're certain that it will increase this year as well. So your kids were here with you yesterday on First Look at Four, uh -huh. and they were talking about their memories. Is there something that stands out to you, not only as the board president, but mm -hmm. as a mom? Sure. And seeing this in our community. So my son was old enough last year to participate in the cardboard boat race hosted by the June Harless. I Center. thought I saw him so in that picture. Yeah. Uh, he was. Uh, they made this great boat, but he and his little best friend were not um, able to really row it to the end, uh -huh. uh, the but they had, fun they had it. a great time doing it, and we're going kayaking this next weekend, uh -huh. so he can learn how to row oh, a good. little bit better. Well, but skills, but I, yeah, yeah we, we loved that. It was a great event, and um, my little girl, she she really, really liked the taste testing at Frios. Hey, so, I'm with her there. Um, There's your son. He's yeah, in his yes. boat. So that's the boat that didn't get as <laughs> yes, far. Yes, it, it was uh -huh. a great hey. boat. It was made really well, but we just got to work on his rolling skiers. Yes. That's all Skills, part of yes. the activity, the fun uh, part it of is. all of this. Um, yeah. Oh, and so great. this is not just one day. It's multiple days, and there's so many things mm -hmm. for families. And talk about pricing, how people sure. get to these events. Right. So all of our events are listed on our website, hcmkids.org slash kidsfast. Each event um, has a different price. Some of the events are free. Mm -hmm. Most of the events hosted at the Children's Museum this year will be $10 a person. Anyone who is two or older will have to purchase a ticket. Okay. We also have a program called Museums for All. So anyone who um, has WIC or um, SNAP can present their card to us, and um, they will be able to enter the museum events at the museum for $2 a person. Mm -hmm. We highly recommend people go to our website and purchase tickets in advance. Um, tickets at our location will be limited. Okay, that way you, you're guaranteed. Correct. And I love the fact that you're helping out some of the families who have a few extra obstacles and a few extra challenges to take their kids to places. And it's a whole week because often we hear of like a one-day event for kids and maybe you're out of town or you have some, Work you know, your schedules. child wakes up sick that day. This way you've got a whole week to check things out. So Tasha, we've been talking to you now for several years about <laughs> the museum. Talk yeah. about the fact that this is going to be opening this summer because this is so exciting for Huntington. So we're thrilled um, that we will likely open this summer. We're still working on some last-minute projects. Uh -huh. We're still fundraising to purchase a few more exhibits okay. um, to hire staff. But we're we're fairly confident that we'll be able to open this summer. Um, anyone who's interested in helping us achieve that goal can go to our website and sign up to volunteer, mm -hmm. or they can sign up to um, donate or support some of our activities in order oh, to help us great. reach our goal of opening this summer. And we keep seeing your pictures on social media of all the different um, parts of the museum. It looks that really are fun under construction. It looks uh -huh. so fun, um, and this kind of gives people a sneak peek mm -hmm. of what's to come in the museum at Kids Fest. Yes, we're we're really excited. And most of our exhibits will be up and running um, during Kids Fest, and we've been thrilled to be able to share the process with everyone. One of the neatest things I've ever done is just watch how different people work and mm -hmm. watch watch them, you know, watch everything progress in the museum. We're just so excited to share with them. We are, too. Yeah, we are. And you can see Beeper uh, made a cameo there <laughs> last year. I think Beeper is going to be around a little bit this year for Kids Fest. Too. Yes. Um, <laughs> the, the Good Time Kids show is going to yes. be wonderful again this year. Well, Tasha, we yes. appreciate you so Stopping by. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you so much yeah. for having me. Yeah, and best of luck with everything. Yes, thank you.